Recently we had a, a client that came to us who uh, was erecting some, uh, call it pallet racking, in a, for a library. And it was internal, uh, it was inside the building. So there was no, and the roof was on, there was no way that the tower crane could, could do the job. We had to plan for, for three different cranes because of the, the nature of the job. There was the start of the job, it was big enough to get our bigger crane in there to throw up the, the first part of the racking. Then we had to pull that out and, and put the 706 in to, to get the motors up quite high. Uh, the 405 couldn't reach them, so we had to talk about that. And then at the end of the job, when they came in, they were, they were building themselves out. So we had to get a slightly smaller crane in there just to finish off. So yeah, we had to tailor that three crane method for the, for the job. They had used other cranes before on similar projects, uh, but they weren't internal. They, they weren't inside the building. They'd had a, a external access, so they could use different cranes. Using the mini crane, um, they were yeah, able to, to, to get into the, the, the tight access area um, to erect their, their racking. Saved the money because they didn't have to rip the roof off the building and use the tower crane. Uh, didn't have to knock a hole in the wall to get a, a, a city crane in there. Um, we had the opening to fit our crane into the building. It cut down on their time, uh, brought it within, within their time frame for the, for the, the uh, principal contractor, because he was you know, pushing them to finish on time. Uh, brought them in into their budget. They didn't have to spend as much as what they thought they were going to spend. And uh, yeah, everyone was happy in the long run. We got a nice testimonial saying how good that was and, and he'll be using us again.